Thing for the 1998 edition of the Valley Victory Final for two-year-old trotting Colts. It is the ninth edition. Four of the eight previous winners went on to win divisional honors. The stakes record, Lindy Lane and Mike Lachance, 156 and 95. Right now, up to the very entertaining voice of Garden State, Larry Letterman. Thank you, Gary. Field all lined up for the ninth Valley Victory. Two-year-old trotters, and they're off. On the outside, Devante sharply leaving it out. Trotted himself, Devante with a very... Bad time break is steered to the outside out of harm's way. Also going off stride. CR Commando will appear to shy away from Devante who cut right in front of him. High Tech dives to the inside. They move around the turn and on the outside season the lead early with mild effort to self-possess. Cruising out there at a length and a half. Starship Enterprise holds on to second early. Two lengths on the inside to the leader's partner, Rafael Ambrosio. And we got Soul Deep trotting away in fourth. Three and a half lengths better in the scatter bunch to Glory Hall off a quarter in 28 seconds flat. Taking the elbow to the back stretch with Sam Pellegrino trotting mid-pack. Glory Hall has gone off strike. Glory Hall is on a break and it happens to fall. First three-eighths of a mile. And comes Angus Hall. Is still in good shape. High tech. Back down trotting is Glory Hall. Hey, coming over to the midway point. On the outside, they switch places. Starship Enterprise. A no-nonsense cult. Leading at a length and a half. In behind, self-possessed and unhurried second. Followed by partner Rafael Ambrosio. Halfway home in 57 and two-fifths. Now the drama continues to unfold and build as they end of the turn. And it is Starship Enterprise, well within himself, leading at a length. On the inside, self-possessed, still sitting chilly in second. Here comes Angus Hall, going to make the bid first over, and is beginning to reel in the leaders. On the inside, Rafael Ambrosio. They leave the five A's, head over to three quarters, and Starship Enterprise, cool under the gun, leading at a length. Outside, Angus Hall. On the inside, self-possessed. Three quarters in an ordinary, 128 and one in fractions we're all working for Starship Enterprise. Into the highway for heroes. And right now, Doherty's giving him the word, and he takes off. Starship Enterprise drives along and strong inside the last eighth of a mile. On the inside, self-possessed is asked for everything, but it doesn't appear to be enough. The horse hasn't moved a muscle, and neither has Doherty. And Starship Enterprise has found the gold at the end of a mile-long rainbow and taken the valley victory. Second, self-possessed. Third, Angus Hall in 156 flat. Look like no-nonsense woman out there. Welcome back. Gary? to Garden State Park. There a look at the happy winner's circle. It starts with Enterprise. Owners, Doherty and Frank and Helen Rubinetti. Frank Rubinetti, a retired restaurateur, has had horses with Doherty for many, many years. Trained by Bill Amire of the Jim Doherty Stable. And again, the well-liked Jim Doherty was in the sulky for the big win. And it is official. There you see Starship Enterprise, 480, 260, 220. Part of the entry, self-possessed. Like in the eliminations, could not catch Starship Enterprise. Second, three and 220. And Angus Hall, another limb winner, third at 240. Last week, this horse had a lot left and uh, plenty left tonight as well. Yes, uh, he's a nice colt. Luck lucky to have him, really. Was there any question whether you were going to go to the front at all tonight? You made that quarter move to the front. Uh, there was no question this colt had to get the lead tonight. Well, I mean, uh, I just had to wait to see how the race was going to shape up. And, you know, it shaped up, so I went to the front. He, he raced any way at all. Uh, he's perfect mannered Colt. Okay, and let's take a look at the uh, top of the stretch here as uh, Self-Possessed is sitting second. Last week, uh, Self-Possessed put in a little late uh, kick, but uh, last week you were able to control the fractions again. Well, you know, he's this, this guy's got quick speed and he's handy, you know. And uh, Breeders' Crown, obviously, that went, that race is uh, on the calendar next week. Yeah, if he comes out of this good, which he's been all right, we'll race him there. Any comparisons to No Nonsense Woman? They're both both pretty good. Right. You know, keep... they're, they're different type horses, but they're both nice nice pair of horses. Well, Jim Doherty couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. Your trainer, uh, William Lemire, has been with you for a long time. And uh, congratulations in the Rubinettis uh, on a great win here in the Valley of Victory. Yeah, thank you very much. Okay, back to you, Gary.